Alright guys, Oink here, and in this video I'm going to be covering the Eiger Nordwin time trial of the Grand Tour, showing you guys how to get a gold time on the uh, on that special event. It's with the Alfa Romeo 8C Competizione, and I'm going to show it twice. Once in the first time I'm going to break down the important sections, and uh, the second time around I'm just going to play it through to you guys so you can see exactly uh, you know how it is in real time. So. For this first corner, there's kind of two approaches to this. Uh, these S bends here, these hairpins. The first is to just put the car into a little bit of slide, put a bit more power down, uh, have the car angled the way you want it to go, and just get, like I said, more power down and uh, through the corner that way. The second way, which is the one I opted for, uh, is one generally with a, a slight bit more uh, grip on the, let's say, traction control, and you basically want to just hug the inside of the corner, keep it nice and clean and stay as tight to the white line as possible and always exit nice and wide so you get a really nice smooth line into the next S-bend and you do that for each of the three corners so you can see here hard braking into the corner and then just let the car roll round it didn't get so wide on that first one but you can see here I just stay nice and wide there power down as soon as you get clear of the corner and uh, away onto the next one you can see there I start as wide as possible and coming through this one it's really important if you are following this method that you get literally as wide to this corner as you can so for the next downhill section you can just line it up roll down and as soon as you see that your car is facing towards the inside of the, the little uh, chicane there hit the power and get through that little hill there and uh, usually make up a lot of time this next corner can be very tricky you can see I just feather the uh, braking there on the in entrance to the corner get down to about 50 miles per hour and the exit to this turn is very hard to get right it's easy to spin out because of the camber you just want to slowly apply the accelerator and also with the steering just be really gentle with it and come out nice and smoothly and uh, try and shift up nice and early so that you're in nice low revs here just tap the brakes on the entrance here to the corner now the important bit is not to put too much power down as you're entering the um, apex of the turn just because of the camber there you really don't want to be caught out right in the middle with too much power otherwise you will spin out and it is a horrible place to be caught right near the end last corner then braking relatively early just before the bit of sand there and just basically let the car roll really nice accelerator control there on that last corner is crucial and just get the power down again as soon as you see the exit of that corner power down in a straight line and uh, that final turn can be pretty important. The final time was 116.744, so I come in about 0.3 of a second uh, before the gold time, obviously at 117. So a relatively good gap there. I've seen better times, of course, there are better times, but uh, this is just my time, and having done this once, I really didn't want to bother trying improving it again. Um, like I said, in terms of uh, settings, I think I was going with a... Uh, uh, what is it? Obviously the standard tyres, you can't choose those. Traction control, I had relatively high, I actually played around with it. I can't annoyingly remember exactly what it was. I definitely tried with some at 3 and 4, I also tried it a bit higher at 5 and 6. Um, but basically with a relatively high traction control, um, had the ASM turned off, you can't use skid recovery force because it's a bit cheat, so that's obviously turned off. And my... Uh, uh, Anti-lock braking ABS is set at 1. I've seen setups where you turn that really high but I just don't see the point because it just makes your braking a lot weaker and it really isn't worth having it any more than 1. So uh, yeah, I mean with this uh, method a high traction control is what you want and you can get that nice control there. Like I said, final time 1.16.744. Hope this has helped you and I'll catch you guys soon. Peace.